Taiwan imposed a net top income tax rate of 45 percent last year and cut tax credits on stock dividends in half. The new measures prompt to high-income individuals and stockholders to push back. And lawmakers wanted to know at a hearing of the legislature's finance committee today if the new government will compromise on the two issues. At his first legislative committee hearing, Finance Minister Xu Yuzhe was asked if he had plans to change tax credits on dividends or the top 45 percent marginal income tax rate. Tell society what kind of government we are. Are we a government that sides with the wealthy or a government that truly pursues fairness and justice? Xu answered that the focus of tax reform this year would be on how to retain and recruit top talent. Creating a friendly tax environment is the bigger priority right now. As for the stock dividend issue, we'll ask for people's opinions in the second half of the year. Xu was also asked about exports, which many believe fell in May from a year earlier to mark a 16th straight month of decline. Exports in May 2015 were the highest of the year, so I'm not too optimistic about last month's export numbers. Meanwhile, KMT lawmaker Lu Xiaoyan wondered where the new government will get the money to finance its long-term care program and asked if it would raise taxes. But Xu sidestepped the question.